Greetings and salutations. My name is Michael Schwann, and today we are checking out Death or Treat. Now, from what I understand about this game, I feel like this game is poorly timed, okay? Because when I was like just kind of glancing at the screenshots, getting stuff ready for this video, it looks like a hand-drawn Metroidvania game where you play as the Grim Reaper. And it was what maybe a month ago that we checked out have a nice death or whatever it's called and th that like these two games are very feel very very similar and that's just a little too close for this one to do wheel wheel do whale since have a nice death already released but I don't know maybe I'm wrong we'll find out so we're gonna start with the teaser trailer from seven months ago in October of 2022 Very cute, though. Is Granny trying to fight for her life so that you can't kill her? I'm not ready to go yet. It was a punkaboo. Little punkaboo. What does that? What? What did all that say at the bottom? Steam, PlayStation, Xbox, and Switch. All right. So that was the teaser trailer official. And then we have another teaser trailer from March. Okay. We're all we're all in Hollow Knight vibes for sure. Yeah, I mean Metroidvania games all definitely have similar airs about them. The timing of this one is just questionable to me. Ghost Mart. I guess we're a ghost instead of a Reaper. Slightly different, but still big hand drawn aesthetics and a Metroidvania game. Gotta take down that Corpo, man. Evil tube. Oh no. Death flicks. Watch it now. I appreciate these references, though. You can pet the dog. Game's great. everyone <laughs> oh it's a witch okay admittedly I did like the idea of it's a granny who's just like not willing to accept that you've come for her so this is the release date trailer from May March 28th 2023 does it go through this whole animation sequence at the beginning again Do we get different? Yeah, this looks th this looks different from what we just watched. Definitely is. Okay. Sometimes people will reuse the same trailer a lot, but like it would just be one that has the release date at the end versus one that doesn't. Real smooth animation though. They did a good job with the art direction. May 5th comes out real soon, real soon. Wait, May 5th, that, that was already, that already happened. But the Steam page is May 11th. Don't know. It's going to be out either now or soon. That's, that's what you got. The Halloween spirit is missing. Play as scary and help him save Hallowtown. Death Retreat is a 2D action roguelike 
and hack and slash with hand-painted environments and traditional animation. Explore the worlds and defeat hordes of enemies using different weapons and skills. Well, that makes a little bit of a difference because Have a Nice Death was definitely much more of just a more traditional Metroidvania rather than trying to be a roguelike experience. So this is going to be more along the lines of like Dead Cells. You can see where it also says similar to Hollow Knight, which that makes sense. So at least it does have a little bit of something that is differentiating itself. Uh, because, like I said, I, I I would be worried about releasing this so close to a game that is so similar to it. And I understand new games come out all the time, and but you do when, when you're going for something that unique and in that specific of a niche, uh, it's a it's a different question to be had on whether you are releasing too close to something else. Um, so I hope that you do well. It looks pretty nice in terms of like you got really good animation work. The trailers were well presented and enjoyable. Um, I just I have concerns about the release window. But I mean, I understand that publishers don't always care. Publishers are like, yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Get out the door and make us some goddamn money. I'm like, well, mm, you would have waited. You would have made a whole lot more money if you would have waited three months. So, anyway, so that's Death or Treat. It looks cute. It looks nice. If it did release already, or maybe it released on, like, PlayStation on May 5th, and then a, m a week later it's releasing on Steam, I could see that being the case. And if so, if you already played it, how did you find it? Did you enjoy it? Have you played both? Uh, I, I And I apologize for referencing Have a Nice Death so much, uh, but if I... It, if you have played that game, then how do you compare the two? And if you did play it and you see this one, or you're like, yeah, man, I'm ready for more, or you're like, no, I got my fill in, let me know. I'd love to hear from you how you sit, what your opinions are, depending on what your situation is. Um, if you want to keep up the conversation elsewhere, two great places to do so are Discord and Twitter, because I like to talk and I love to talk some more, like we've been talking to chat, uh, because we did record this video live on stream. We stream on Twitch four days a week, and I would love to see you there. If you enjoyed this video, please leave it a like. If you want to catch future videos please subscribe to the channel you can watch one of the other videos on the channel or if i see you in the live stream thank you and enjoy